Setting up an email marketing automation or solution inside your WordPress online store is an important step that you need to take right away because it helps you for different reasons. It will help you build a relationship with your current customers because you can send them follow-up emails maybe to train them um, to uh, the products that they have, they have bought and also it can help you increase your sales or revenue by giving by upselling these uh, customers uh, for other products maybe the, the there is a special discount you can send them a special discount for another product that they can sell and of course they setting up an email marketing automation will help you have a database or a system for all the customers that uh, have interacted with your online store so we can uh, send them or offer them a special discounts or let them know about your products in the future to do this we will need to install in the fluent crm plugin which is an amazing I consider it the best email marketing platform for WordPress just right now. You, we will need to install two uh, versions of Fluence. We need to install the free, the free uh, plugin, and also we need to install the uh, Pro plugin because the Pro plugin will give you the ability to set up these automated emails. So you will find a link for the Pro plugin down below in this video description. So let me show you how you can set up or how you can kill, uh, how you can connect the WooCommerce. Uh, products to Fluence CRM and then how you can set up email marketing uh, or automated emails to be sent out to your uh, to your uh, customers. So first we need to um, set up to install uh, Fluence CRM plus the WooCommerce. I think you have already you already know how you can set up WooCommerce and Fluence CRM. So I will skip this part in this video. So once you install um, uh, Fluence CRM, you need to go to the settings. And here you need to add or complete some information. Maybe you need to add, I think you need to add your business name, your full address and upload your logo. And for the email settings here, you need to set up which email with that will be used to send this email. Uh, maybe from your content or support email or sales support or whatever email that you want to be used as the sender of all of these emails. Then you need to set up an SMTP or email service settings because Fluence RM is developed to send emails to, um, is developed to um, set up an email marketing automation platform, but it's not developed to be able to use as a server for sending this email. So you need to uh, install another free plugin called Fluence SMTP to connect it with another um, 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 sending service such as Amazon SS, Mailgun, SendGrid, or SendingBlue. You'll find another video down below that describes this whole process. It is a very easy process. So once you do this, again, you need to add your license key once you buy the the pro version of Loan CRM, you need to add the license key right here in this uh, license management tab. So once you do this, you need to set up your list. So to set up your list, you go to lists. And here let's add like a one list called customers list. So let's call this click create new and let's call this customers and let's click create. Then we need to set up our tags. So we know we can differentiate. Yes, this list will contain all of our, will contain all of our customer or contain all our customers. Then we need to differentiate who put product A, who put product B, because if someone put product A, then we need to send them follow-up emails to, uh, to ask them or to offer them a discount for our product B. To set up your tags, you simply again to go to contacts and click tags. And to add a tag, let's just click create tag and let's call this product A and click create. And let's create another tag and call it uh, product B and let's click create. And now we have set up our list and also our tag. Now let's connect the the people who buy the products to their WooCommerce products. I will not go to the full setup of WooCommerce because I think you know how you can set it up. So I will just go to WooCommerce and click that's um, and add a new product. Let's click add new and let's call this product A. And of course you need to add a price. Let's call this like 97 price and you can choose which, which whether it is a single product or maybe an online course product. And here down you, once you install Fluent CRM, um, and connected to WooCommerce, you'll find a tab called New uh, or Fluent CRM. So we click here, and here you can connect this product to which tag. As I mentioned, if someone um, uh, we have already created a tag called Product A, so if someone buys Product A, we need to connect it to uh, to the tag of Product A. So in here we can add just add a Product A tag, and let's click Publish. Now, when someone buys product A, they will be tagged as a product A subscriber or customer. So let me add another product and call this product B. So again, let's click add new. Let's call this product B. And let's give this a, um, a price of 99. And again, let's connect it with product B tag. And let's click publish. Now we have our two products. So the scenario following here is that when someone buys product A, we need to send them a discount code for, for product B. To set up a discount code, you need to go to WooCommerce 
and click coupons and here let's create our first coupon let's click create your first coupon and let's call this um 20 percent off or 20 off and let's call this like a um, percentage discount and let's give it like 20 percent and let's click publish and now we have our coupon code so now we need to go to Fluencer and set up automation for someone if someone buys product A. So to set up an automation, again, this is a pro uh, feature. You need to buy Fluencer in Pro. You'll find the link for Fluencer in Pro down below. So we need to go to Fluencer M and click automations. And here you can set up a or create a new automation. And we need to add an internal label, label for something like who bought, bought product A. And now we need to set up a trigger. So one, what shall ha what should happen th then for this automation to start? Once you install WooCommerce, you'll find a new tab called WooCommerce. So let's say order completed. Let's click continue. And now we need to choose which product uh, uh, that should trigger this automation. So here let's choose product A and let's click save settings. So what shall happen after someone uh, buys this product A? Let's, I think we can just, you know, send them, you can here choose which actions that uh, you can make. Wait for a few days or apply a list or apply a tag. We have already applied a tag uh, inside the WooCommerce settings. So I think the best way now is to send them a custom email. So you just click send a custom email. And again, you can add the email subject here. Let's call this congratulations. So I have added the subject meant to be congratulations for buying product A. And even you can add the name by, you know, just adding a colon here. And once you click the three dots, here you can choose their first name. So once someone adds their um, first name, the subject email will say congratulations for buying product A and the contact or the customer name. And here you can add your um, um, email. You can add just say hi. Um, if you like to um, add their name again here, you click this icon and you choose first name and place it here so it will just it will just say hi and the first contact name so again you hear this is you can add like any type of you can add buttons here you will you can add images maybe you need to add like an image of your product to add an image you click enter and click the plus button and you choose image image and you can either uh, either upload it or click media library and choose your product maybe this is a calendar product so i'll just choose this one and click select so this is an image of the product and um, once you do this you just click save settings so now once someone um, buy the product a the, this automated email will be sent to them so let's wait like for two days or one day even and send them another email with an offer so let's click um, you can do this by clicking the, sub the plus button and choosing wait for an x amount let's wait for two days and click save settings and again, let's send them um, a custom email. So we just for the actions, we send it send a custom email. And let's call this a special discount. And here, let's add our text again. And let's add our discount here. Let's say special discount code. And let's add our our code, it's which is 20 off. And let's make this bold here by highlighting this and click making this bold and again you can add like maybe uh, a button for them to buy the the product you can click the plus button here and search for button and you add the button here and you say buy product b and you can also you know align this centered and of course you can change the um, the background color to whatever you want maybe you may need to make it like red or green sorry so this is how you can set it up so once let's click save settings again so now you wait for someone to buy the product so if you have set up like five similar emails because uh, maybe the first email will be the discount code then the testimonial code then maybe you send them an email to talk about your feature the the product features but what if they just buy from the, the first email? Should you send them uh, the other emails too? I don't think this is a smart way. So what you can do about this, you, this is where Fluencer in shines it and it, it does the same job that Cat Active Campaign Convert Kit and many popular um, uh, email marketing platform does. You can set a, set a goal for this funnel. So let me show you how you can do this. Again, you just click the plus button and you check, uh, you check condition and you choose check condition. So what is the condition? 
The condition is that when someone is um, buys a product, or choose product, and you choose product B, which is the product that we are giving discount for. So we choose safe settings. So this is a condition. So if someone buys this, after this email, if someone buys this product with the special discount, if they buy the, 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 the product, if yes, then we can just say, stop sending the emails by clicking an, act, an action. And down below, we can choose like, um, which is um, in this funnel here. So no further emails will be sent to this, to this uh, customer about this special discount. But if they don't buy the product with our discount or any other way, we can keep sending them an email because emails so we can just say wait for another if they don't buy just wait for another like one day maybe and click save settings and add an action and send them another um, uh, custom email you can say like um, product B features of course you can like be more creative when it comes to email subject lines so again you can add our features here if you like to add like a list again you click the plus button and you search for a list and maybe you can just list your uh, product features right here so we can have them uh, we can send them features of all of your products and again you click save settings this is again you can set up another email full of email until they buy once they buy the product at any stage this funnel should stop so this is how easily you can set up email marketing automation for your uh, woocommerce or online store so you can Collect the contact details of the customers of your online store and connect them with WooCommerce and add them to a list, a tag, and send them a special discount and set up a funnel in a certain way so you can't bother your customers who already bought your uh, products. So hopefully you find this video helpful. Again, if you decide to consider, if you consider to buy Fluence Arabia, you'll find a link down below for the Fluence RM Pro. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please don't forget to um, give me a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to our channel because I create similar videos for the coming 100 days. Thank you so much and see you in the next video. Bye for now.